Hey everyone, Kira with Creation In Between and today I have a product review to share. Uh, the nice people over at Chocola reached out to me a little while ago and asked if I would like to review one of their products. And they were nice enough to send me these uh, 30 count chalk markers. Now I have never used chalk markers before so um, this is going to be a first but these look pretty cool. Um, I only opened the box. I haven't actually used any of them yet but um, before I do that um, these apparently work on all non-porous surfaces and they have a six millimeter reversible tip which I think is actually pretty cool. And these are all of the different kinds of colors that, sorry there's a glare on this, um, uh, this is all the colors that are in this particular box. I know they also sell metallic uh, chalk markers as well but I just received these. Um, so they work best on chalkboards, whiteboards, blackboards, windows, glass, ceramics, and other non-porous surfaces. They are child safe, water-based, and non-toxic. Um, apparently they wash off your clothes, which is nice to know. Um, low odor, acid-free, blah, blah, blah. They're also quick drying and long lasting. Um, from what I've read, once they are dry, they won't really smudge. You'll still get like a chalky residue as if you were using, you know, chalk. But the markers will wipe off of the surface you put it on with just water, you know, like a wet cloth. I figured I would do a quick swatch test. So to do that, I'm going to try it on the other thing that Chalkala sent me. And it was this nice chalkboard. Um, it has a stand, which is pretty cool, um, but I'm not going to use that right now because I'm on my table. But in the chalkboard also comes with a, what size is this? So this is another six millimeter uh, white. So like if you were just to purchase the chalkboard, you would still get, you know, some things to write with, which is nice. And you wouldn't have to go purchase the whole set right away. Okay, so let's look at all the colors. So again, there are 30 in this one box and they're all six millimeter uh, tips. Now, like I read on the box, so apparently these are reversible tips. Um, oh wow, okay, so they are. I don't know if you could see this, but um, you have like that regular tip and then a chisel tip, which is really pretty cool. So I guess it would just slip right back in like that. It's easy to do. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> I really like that. All right, so um, now to get these started, um, apparently it takes a little while. You have to really shake them with the cap on and I think holding the, the tip of it like up. You shake for about 30 seconds and then you gotta like press down. Uh, here, I'll show you. So we'll shake it. Okay, I'm just gonna test it on a little piece of paper here. So you're supposed to hold it flat down and just keep like pumping it. So as you can see, the color is slowly starting to seep out. And there we go. <laughs> that was easy. It actually didn't take that long. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that real quick for all of these off camera and then I will do a swatch test.
All right, so I finished the swatch test and I let it dry. Um, it doesn't smudge once you let it dry and there doesn't seem to really be any residue on my hand. I don't know if I was just reading other reviews where they, you know, depends on the surface really, but I have not read a bad review and I ha don't have a bad review <laughs> myself at all. I really, really love these markers. Now, some of them dry a lot faster and it all depends on how much you use, like with these little squares, um, yeah, see like that, it's still not completely dry because a lot of the pigment was coming out. So, you know, just let it completely dry, but even still, it's just it's kind of like a chalky residue. So it's exactly like chalk, <laughs> duh. <laughs> um, the array of colors are really beautiful. Um, some are a little too similar to my liking, but it's not really a gripe. Um, I don't mind it. There are some awesome neon colors like this orange right there. I don't know if it's gonna come across on the camera as much as it does in person. Um, so there are some like neon colors in here, which is awesome. I really like the caps on these because they snap closed and they're not loose. They stay on there, so I wouldn't be afraid of these leaking at all. On the pen itself, uh, it says mostly used on mirrors, chalkboards, car glass, plastics, and ceramics. So basically any non-porous surface, these apparently will work on and they will wipe off clean even after being left on there and after, you know, after drying. But again, I absolutely love these markers. I've never used chalk markers before and I'm definitely going to be trying to figure out different projects that I can do with these. Uh, but the colors are very pigmented, they're vibrant. I personally hate my handwriting. I don't have the best handwriting. Um, I could do kind of, you know, that and that's basically it. <laughs> but I, could, I would assume that these would be actually really nice for those who do lettering because it's very smooth, they're creamy, um, and they don't run too much except right at the beginning. Like with these, because I had just opened them, everything was like right there, um, but really they didn't run at all. And in the box, Chocola actually sent me these little chalk labels, which is pretty cool. So I'll probably use them for a project later on. So let me find something glass or something else I can test these on. So here's my little jar of gouache, <laughs> my little Dollar Tree, Oop. my little Dollar Tree thing. I'm just gonna just quickly draw on this because it was right here. Uh, let's do... So the round nib, it's um, a little too big to do tiny little details, um, but they do sell, yeah, see like right here, this is like super runny at the moment. But they do sell um, on their website, ooh, that does not look good. <laughs> um, smaller, like I think one millimeter tipped um, markers. Like I said, they also have, um, metallics and all that kind of stuff okay so I was trying to do stars and clearly <laughs> doesn't look good with this big nib but you get the point it goes on really well so I'm just gonna let this dry and um, well, I guess I gotta finish it oh that looks so bad I messed that up it's not the markers fault that was my fault but yeah if you want to do small details I would definitely get the smaller tipped markers but yeah, I'm gonna let I'm gonna set this aside, let it dry, and see what happens. What else can I draw on? Hmm. I have this red mug from Dollar Tree. Um, let's see. Let's do the light blue. I suck at writing, but I'm gonna try it anyway. Wow. So I really love how these go on. It's smooth, there's no streaks, and the color is just, it's vibrant. It's probably not, it's probably a little muted with my ring light on it right now, but um, the colors are really, really beautiful.
Again, my handwriting sucks, but this these would work great for anyone who's like really good with lettering. <laughs> They're very, very smooth. Okay, so I let it dry for a few minutes and um, it does scratch off, which, you know, it's chalk markers, so it's gonna do that. Um, but it's not smudging just when you touch it, which is, I mean, it's coming off of my fingers. So there it is. It doesn't really do that on here as much, only a little bit, but like different surfaces, I guess certain colors just, you'll get that chalky residue as if you were really using chalk. So that's something to be expected. Um, but you know, it stays on here really well. The colors are really nice. And it's just a, uh, and it's a great way to decorate your stuff. So any non-porous surface, these markers will work on. Um, I tried three different ones and let's see how easy it is to remove it. Now, they said you can just get a wet towel, uh, like a paper towel and you can clean it off that way, but I have baby wipes down in my office, so I'm just gonna try one of those. There you go. It really does wipe off super easily. So you can use these safely on your mirrors, on your car windows, um, maybe if you were trying to label like um, cups for a party, you know, whether it's your drinking cups or you wanted to like have jars of utensils, that kind of thing, um, and not have it be permanent, this would work perfectly. It comes right off, no problem doesn't really smudge much it's perfect and I really I am thrilled with these markers and cannot wait to use them on more stuff so if you're interested in trying these charcola chalk markers you can go on the website at chalkola.com and purchase your own they have a variety of different um, sizes they have the metallics like I said I saw that they had like vintage colors which look really cool um, and you can use the discount code that I will provide in the description below to get 10% off of your order. Also, they have been willing to let me run a giveaway. So if you would like to enter that, again, the link will be in the description below. Um, you can win your own set of the 30 count chalk markers like I have here. Just by entering and doing a couple things from that link, and you have until February 22nd. It's super easy, just click the link. It's pretty self-explanatory. Um, you can have more than one entry in it. So the more you do, the more entries you get and the better chance of winning. And that's it for today's video. I want to thank Chocola for sending me this awesome product of theirs. I really, really do love it. As I said, I have never used chalk markers before, but I will definitely be using them a lot more. And this chalkboard is really cute, so I'll have to display it somewhere in my house. So again, you have until February 22nd to enter the giveaway if you would like to try to win your own set of Chocola chalk markers. And I guess I'll see you in the next video. See ya!